ever really feels prepared to have a baby, let alone an early baby. It's very scary when anything unexpected happens in your life, especially when it involves your family and your cherished baby. When you go to the hospital and hear that you're going to have a baby much earlier than expected, it's shocking, it's exciting. There's a ton of emotions that go into it. We were nervous. I mean, we didn't know what was going on just because everything was new to us. Once we got here, we were greeted with open hands. Everybody was great. Brought us to our room, showed us where the kitchen was. Help yourself to anything. It was just a really good feeling. Once you get to the Ronald McDonald House and you have your own room, your own shower, your own bathroom, your own space to relax, you really appreciate it after being in the hospital where they try to give you privacy, but nothing's private in the hospital. Once we were able to get here and just decompress, it was so nice. We were able to wash our clothes and just have that bit of normalcy to our lives. Whenever we got here in the evenings, we didn't have to worry about preparing ourselves uh, dinner. Jerry was working on finding a volunteer to make dinner for us. Dinner time came and she's like, we have turkey and stuffing. And I don't think you really realize how comforting a meal can be. We had the whole spread, you know, the turkey, the gravy, the stuffing and all that. So it was nice to be able to go in there and get our plates and sit down. Being at the house for several days, you get to know many of the volunteers, many of the staff members, and you do form those connections. You get to know everybody's life story and they get to learn a little bit about you and you make special bonds. I think it would have been a lot more stressful just because you have travel. Being at the Ronald McDonald House really sets the parents up for success because when you're just a few minutes away from your baby. You don't have to travel and make that trip. So you are able to be fresh and clear-minded when you get to the hospital to be able to understand what's going on and what you need to do and just to be wholeheartedly there for your baby. Every time you come here, it brings back some strong emotions, uh, but they're good emotions. You just, you just feel that whenever you come back. It's always fun to bring Knox back. The volunteers that were here when we were here and the house um, staff members that remember when he was born, it's always fun to kind of show him off and say, hey, you know, we used to show you pictures of this little tiny baby and here he is, a toddler, thriving and doing so well. It's always exciting and always challenging to come back to Ronald McDonald House because you do have so many cherished memories. Coming back, it's like coming to a home that you did spend a lot of time in. Every family has a story. We share the Brunetti story with you because we believe it will make an impact. We care for families so they can care for theirs. Care, it's what motivates us. It turns long nights into brighter days moments into milestones, strangers into families, and donors like you into partners that make our house a home. The Gift of Light, Gift of Love campaign will raise the essential funds needed to keep our house and our family room operating throughout 2025. When you give, you become a local part of our global community of care. Please give a gift of love today.